International Relations Minister Dr. Nale Dipando, hoping that the visit by Singapore's Prime Minister Lee Henson um, Long will strengthen ties between the country and South Africa. Pando also saying she welcomes the inquiry into the United States allegations that the country has supplied Russia with ammunition in its protracted war with Ukraine. Our reporter Atim Tongan caught up with uh, Dr. Naledi Pando as President Sol Ramaphosa gears up to host the Singapore Prime Minister. Well, preparations are underway here in Parliament where President Sir Ramaphosa is expected to host a lunch and an engagement with the uh, Prime Minister of Singapore. But, of course, he was welcomed, I believe, by the Minister of International Relations, uh, Minister Naledi Pando. Thank you for joining us on Newsroom. Uh, talk to us about the significance of this visit, given the fact that uh, this year marks 30 years of relations between the two countries. Well, uh, as you know, uh, Singapore is one of the most uh, successful of the East Asian uh, countries. Um, it's a small island country, but absolutely incredible in terms of its uh, financial ability, its financial services sector, logistics and other areas. So it's a country we want to do business with, essentially. Being an island, it also depends uh, significantly on imports, particularly of agricultural products. So I think there's massive opportunity uh, for our agricultural sector because Singapore needs beef, they need pork, they need uh, citrus or vegetables, everything uh, comes into the country from elsewhere. And being a country with a strong agricultural sector, I think we must take up those opportunities. Another update with regards to the issue around the allegations that were made uh, by you know, the U.S. about the provision and the supply of arms to Russia. Now, the president obviously announced an inquiry which would be led by a retired judge. Are there timelines there? And what further can you tell us from your engagements with your U.S. counterparts? Well, let me say that I'm looking forward to this independent panel more than any other person, because if I can have answers, it's going to help me in the work that I do. So uh, I really hope the panel will be set up soon and that it will do its work in quick time. Um, I am aware that South Africa has a very strict regime for uh, licensing and allowing arms uh, sales. So while it is the private sector that sells arms, government doesn't. So that's why I was incensed by the comments of the uh, USA ambassador, because he said South Africa implying government, whereas it may be a company, I don't know, you know, that sold we don't as government. So um, I'm really keen that we have an inquiry and we get to the bottom uh, of this matter. I do know uh, that there is a concern that we are not supporting our friends from the north in this current conflict between Russia and Ukraine. And uh, I hope we're not using tails to try and squeeze South Africa in a particular direction. We will resist uh, uh, such pressure. For News from Africa on Channel 405, I'm Tim Tongana in Parliament.